Human rights activists highlighted the vulnerable situation in which families of victims of state repression are. They also show figures of femicide and of attacks against freedom of speech, which were committed after the elections of 2017. The IACHR commission being here is already a positive thing, that the people are here, that the victims are here, that people provide evidence and data on the human rights violations, this all is positive. IACHR representatives have listened to the testimonies of victims and share reactions from their first meetings. Our first meeting with them left us greatly concerned. There are some very specific issues that the country has to take into account, and the main one is justice, to give just reparations to the victims. For the most vulnerable sectors, the visit of this commission will not guarantee the attacks will stop, but at least the government will be exposed. We are dealing with an authoritarian administration. It's a dictatorship and therefore all journalists that are not part of the government's agenda become the target and can be attacked at any time. IACHR representatives assure that they will visit the prisons where those who participated in electoral protests in 2017 are being detained.